Okay, so in this video, I'm going to tell you guys how you can get real Instagram followers. So let's go. Today, I'll be sharing some things that I have learned from my journey to almost 30,000 followers on Instagram. Also, some tips that I have got from the people who work for Instagram. So watch this video till the end and I'm sure it will help you guys out a lot. Now, when I say real followers, I want you guys to understand the difference between real followers and fake followers. See, everyone on Instagram wants to get a big number of followers on their profile. And some of them are very impatient. They choose the shortcut, which is buying followers. But the thing that they don't understand is that by buying followers, they are not reaching out to any real profiles. They are just getting some computer generated fake profiles which are commonly known as bots because they behave like robots. They are designed to like your picture, comment on it and also follow you. But the thing is, if you are a business or a person like me who is a photographer and who wants to showcase his work on Instagram in order to get some more contracts from Instagram, it's totally useless because you are not reaching out to any real people. Practically, you are still talking to yourself. So it's a total waste of money and time. So I recommend stay away from this. Not only because it's a waste, but also Instagram is taking very strict actions against these accounts. If you are using these fake services and your accounts get reported, you can even lose your account permanently. So stay safe and stay away from all of this. So leaving all this behind, let's get you guys some real followers, which will genuinely like your work and help you further grow on Instagram. How? Well, Instagram's new algorithm determines which posts to put on explore pages and on top of hashtag results based on how well it performs with your own followers. So if you have genuine followers who will genuinely like your work, chances are you will keep on growing no matter what. So the first thing that you need to do in order to get these real followers is to socialize. Now, real or virtual, in any community to get yourself noticed, you have to interact with other people. And to interact with people on Instagram, we have these three beautiful things called like, comment and share. So go ahead, like the post of other creators that you think are relatable to your account, comment on their post and share them on your stories as well. Now, what will this do is it will get you noticed. We are just trying to build a relationship with other accounts. So do this and these people will come back to your profile and surely check your profile out. And if you are doing the second thing properly, I'm sure these visitors will turn into your followers. So the second thing is to post only good quality content. Now, whenever someone is visiting your profile, you have to make sure that they get impressed by your post so that they don't leave without following you. And the best way to do that is to post only good quality content. Now by good quality content, I don't only mean high quality photos and videos. Those are important obviously, but you also have to keep in mind that you are sticking to one particular category. For example, you say you are a food blogger. So your feed should be filled with food shots, but you are posting everything from your own selfies to your pet's picture or any other random image which doesn't belong to that category. Chances are the people visiting your profiles won't follow you because they were expecting a food blogger and they were expecting some food related posts. So in order to convert each and every visitor of yours into a follower, make sure that you are posting only good quality content. The third thing, be consistent. Make sure you're making a post on Instagram in every two days, or you can do it daily as well, depending on your content. But being consistent on Instagram is very important. The more you post, the more are your chances of gaining new followers daily. And also try to interact with other accounts on a daily basis, because that will tell Instagram that you are an active user and active users on Instagram are ranked higher than others everywhere. So try to give Instagram at least one hour of your day and believe me, you will start gaining followers on a daily basis. And the fourth thing, use hashtags seriously. Now you might not know, but using the right hashtags can increase your reach a lot, which means new followers. And it's all only about finding those right hashtags. And the best way to do that is to follow your seniors. See which hashtags are they using on their post. And if you think that your post is similar to theirs, you can even copy those hashtags. But keep one thing in mind, that you don't post any irrelevant hashtags. For example, you have used a hashtag sunset on your post but your post doesn't have to do anything with sunsets. So the chances are people viewing it from that hashtag may not like your picture, which will tell Instagram that it is not a good photo and your reach might go down. So keep that in mind that you are using only relevant hashtags. And if you are using only right hashtags, your followers will increase automatically. And if you are a photographer like me, you are most welcome to come to my profile and copy these hashtags. But do you know how to copy hashtags? Because Instagram doesn't allow you to copy and paste hashtags from others posts. So the best way to do that is to open your internet browser in your smartphone, log into Instagram, go to the account of that person whose hashtags you want to copy and just tap and done. 
here you go now you have copied all the hashtags and you can use them on your post so the fifth thing that you have to do in order to get more real instagram followers is to use all four surfaces of instagram now this is something that i have heard a lot from none other than the people who are working for instagram and they have told me that we have to use all these four surfaces consistently in order to get the best results so what are these four surfaces the first one is your post the second one is your stories the third one is your instagram live and the fourth one is your igtv now they also told me how to use all these four surfaces and coming to post they said that it is something permanent so you should only keep it for your top-notch quality content but coming to instagram stories they said that you should use it to interact with your existing followers using all the creative tools that you have there what this will do is tell instagram that your existing followers are interacting with your account a lot which will indicate that it is a good account and Instagram will start suggesting your account to people who have similar interests as your existing followers, which means more followers. Now Instagram Live is also another great tool to interact with your audience but on a more personal level, as most of the content that you are posting might not include your face, so going live can make that personal connection that your account was missing. Now coming to IGTV, it is the latest edition from Instagram where you can post your videos which are longer than 1 minute in length, both horizontally and vertically. And you can use this platform best in showing behind the scenes of the things that you post. Now as it is the latest edition from Instagram, Instagram is actually promoting a lot of users who are creating videos on IGTV on a daily basis. So as I said, I heard all of this from the people who are working for Instagram. So make sure that you use all the four surfaces to get the best results. Now if you are wondering how I got into contact with the people from Instagram, well I'm in a program called Born on Instagram which is led by Instagram itself and there they are showing us all the inner workings of the app and sharing tips like these to help us grow on the platform. So this was it for now but as I will learn new things from them I'll make sure that I share them with you as well. So if you don't want to miss out on that make sure you have subscribed to my channel and click that bell icon so that you never miss another video from my side. And if you genuinely like this video don't forget to like it, leave your comments and share it with your friends. I'll see you in the next video till then bye bye. Thank you.